the best way to do this is to take your clothes off. Kyle, take your clothes off. It's not what you're asking me to do, is it? It that is. Was last week. Those were the big ones that were I knew right it. over there. Are you going to replate them? Yeah, mm, just cloning them. But what the problem is right now, and this is quite the problem. So I saw just a few mealybugs right here. I was like, oh, don't worry. I'll take care of it next week. And then boom, over here. And what happens is, um, I think, I'm pretty sure these things are asexual. Like one literally like in caves on itself and creates a thousand new ones. It's like in a poof of smoke, poof. You just go over the whole garden and destroy everything. So I'm gonna teach people how to get rid of mealybugs and all other insects in the safest, most gentle, organic way, which took me years to learn. Um, so, what I used to do back in the day is I actually used to spray them with alcohol and try to like melt them, but that burns the plants. And the other thing that's difficult is you need an insecticide, but you can't use one that is systemic. And if you're a part of the Trichoceros Club on Facebook, you know why. So, what poison can you use that will kill the bugs that's non-systemic that will work? And the thing that actually works is 100% pure, raw sulfur. Sorry, it's a heavy bag. So that is 99% uh, pure sulfur. And so I'm gonna show you how to hit every cactus in the greenhouse with sulfur um, in kind of a cool cactus tech way that I invented. All right, so uh, to get rid of mealybugs, spider mites, red mites, basically all other insects, uh, pure sulfur is what you want to do. Why? Because this stuff is poison to things that live that aren't plants. Um, as, you, as many of you know, sulfur is actually a nutrient. So the residual sulfur that actually goes on the dirt and gets watered in is beneficial for the plants. So this won't hurt your plants, but it will definitely kill your bugs. Um, here's the deal with the sulfur though. This is pure sulfur. You do not want to just put on a pair of clothes that you're okay with you know, smelling bad, because when you put that on the wash, it will make all your other clothes smell like sulfur, and everything will smell like sulfur. Um, maybe that's just because I'm a super taster, but I don't want to smell like sulfur for two weeks. I don't want my house to smell like sulfur, and I really don't want my cute, red-headed, gorgeous yogi girlfriend to smell like sulfur. So, the best way to do this is to take your clothes off. Kyle, take your clothes off. Asking you to do, is it? it is. I I know you didn't expect it, but um, if you don't want to smell like sulfur, get naked. So while my girlfriend's getting naked, um, <laughs> hey, stop. this is 100% raw sulfur. You don't want to get this anywhere near you or your clothes. Um, you also really don't want to breathe this stuff in. So with my coronavirus haircut, I will do the typical corona look because really you just don't want the stuff in your face no you'll be fine girlfriend don't worry she's concerned all right you want a bowl with a good sized lip and i'll show you why in a second all right that is a shitload of sulfur probably more than we need but the point is, is we're gonna bomb this place. Uh, we're gonna gas it with sulfur and make this a sulfur dusting. So you definitely wanna open the door. You wanna start in the back and work your way out of the greenhouse, not into it. Now, the tech that I came up with is dust off. If you spray this into this bowl, it pushes it up and out and creates a cloud. And I wanna cloud the cactus in here everywhere. I'm also going to take the water out of the room and anything else like this because you just don't want to water your plants with pure sulfur, but it is okay if some gets on the dirt. My girlfriend is totally naked and she's super cute. <laughs> All right, come here, girlfriend. Start, we're going to start at the back. Don't get too close because I don't want you to breathe this stuff in, but I want to show that we're going to spray it up and out kind of dust.
That is how you get rid of the bugs. <laughs> so um, that was great. That was awesome. I didn't taste or smell any sulfur because of this. And that powder is just going to um, pack the greenhouse in there. And now my clothes won't smell like sulfur. Obviously, we're going to go take a shower. And I really wish you could see how beautiful my girlfriend is right now. She's so 